All right, you guys, so. Hi, I'm Mike, the OG Geek. Remember how to tell you don't do this at home? That's exactly what you don't do. And this is my buddy Seth, from what's popping. We're here in Orlando for Megacon, but that's for another video. This, well, this is a bad idea. And this is my buddy John, also known as Humphrey, creator of Bad Idea. Don't try it at home. <laughs> we'll get back to this. But first, let's go on a hunt. Yo, yo, what's up, OG, Triple OG? All right, you guys, we're at the Coliseum of Comics. Gonna check out what they have for pops, statues, figures, and who knows? See what else we can find. Got a little group piggy bank. That's nice. That's funny. Every time you put money in it, it should dance. <laughs> Shit, for 30 bucks, it should do something. Also got a gauntlet piggy bank. Let's see what they have over here for statues. Oh, they have the gladiator Hulk. My favorite Hulk. This thing is sick, bro. You know what suit that is? That is the, um, I think that's the extremist one. I don't know what suit that is, but it's a nice though. Yeah, I don't know. I think that's the extremist. Because that's not the, that's not any of the, that's not any of the new ones. Yeah, yeah, it's Iron, uh, it says it on the back, Sideshow Iron Man Extremist. Extremis set statue. Nice piece. Yeah, the Extremis, the Extremis one is from the, uh, that's kind of like what the, um, oh, you saw Iron Man 3, right? Yeah. Yeah, so that's basically what the Extremis is when the suit, when the suit would actually come, come to him. Come to him, yeah. yeah. Very nice. They've got all the Marvel Pops here. And the Disney ones are behind me. Which is the two biggest things I collect, so that's convenient. See if we can find anything. This I like how it looks. I don't know what it is though. I've never seen this movie, but the pop is very nice. Very colorful. I don't have this one. Should pick it up. Let's see. Just got here to Orlando. I'm not trying to start buying a bunch of stuff that I gotta take with me. I know I'm gonna buy a lot of stuff tomorrow, probably at the show. Or not a lot of stuff, but I don't know. I don't know what I'm buying yet. Captain America, Infinity War. They don't have much for newer pops, it's mostly older stuff, but they do have a lot of statues and figures. No Marvel Legends, but they do have a lot of Marvel Select, so that's pretty cool. So Seth and I have both have been talking about this one. Neither of us have pulled the trigger, but I'm sure one of us will soon. <laughs> what do you think? Uh, probably so, probably sooner, <laughs> than, be? Sooner, than, sooner than later. <laughs> it's just a question of whether I want that one or I want the one that's next to it in the black yeah, they the got two of suit. Them. Or I could just buy them both. That that's and that'll, makes and sense. That'll end the you could right make there. them bookends. Yeah, exactly. And that'll end the debate <laughs> right there. The new suit is actually limited edition for free, uh, free comic book day. I think oh, we only okay. have four more left. Oh, okay. This one? Yeah. Yep. I don't know. I like the way this one pops more. Yeah. For display like the colors that. and everything. Yeah, I like that one too. It looks more um, close to like uh, what was it like the the McFarlane the uh, McFarlane Spider Man. Let's see. We're staying close to here, so 
I don't find anything at the con tomorrow, which I doubt. I'm pretty sure oh, I'll find dude. a couple of things. You're gonna trust me. You're gonna. <clears throat> yeah, yeah. I'm planning on going broke tomorrow. <laughs> this thing is cool. Yeah, see, that's the Gen One. That's the Gen One Prime, obviously, minus the uh, the wings in the back. The wings weren't in the cartoon or the comic books. No, that was in that was more, that was in the movie, not in the comic books. The wings? Not on the TV, not in the oh. cartoon either. Yeah. I don't remember them in the movies either. I haven't seen them in a while. Though. <clears throat> they do have another one back here that I love, but I don't love the price. <laughs> but I love the statue itself. Let me show it to you guys. Check that bad boy out. I think it's beautiful. Love the way that looks. Don't love that, but I do love that. I hope you guys can see it. Okay, it's very high up, so I'm having to reach up to show it to you guys. So I hope I'm getting it in frame. Very nice. All right, that's enough of that. Let's look at the Marvel Selects, see what they have. <coughs> I've got this Iron Spider. I keep meaning to pick up, but I haven't yet. I don't know why. I do like it. The Iron Man's I'm not a big fan of for Marvel Select. Let's see. Captain America looks real nice, so I got this one already. But as far as Marvel Selects go, I like that one, I like this one. Let's see what else they got. I love this one, I own this one too. It's probably my favorite Marvel Select in my collection. It's very nice. Got a Wonder Woman Mafex. I don't see a price on this, so they should put it back down. That's 80. Okay. It's not that bad. Some more statues, busts, stuff like that. They have a lot of statues. A lot. I would say their main thing here is comic books. They have a lot of comic books. It's crazy the amount they have. The second will be the statues. I think we're gonna start heading out, go somewhere else. I don't think there's much here that we're gonna end up picking up. We just left the Coliseum of Comics. We didn't pick anything up. We decided to come to a Target to see what we could find. So let's see. Oh, all right. So we just left Target because <laughs> there's absolutely nothing here. Wow, look how dry this thing is. Unless you wanna buy a giant mystery egg as seen on YouTube. A mystery egg? Yeah, I don't know what the hell's in here. It is a mystery. There's guaranteed a plushie in every mega egg. What's the value? Uh, I think it says no, no. So does it say like a value? It just says value. Oh. We don't know what the value is. But it's a giant mega egg. Okay. Target's coming up with different ways to make some quick buck. All right, I'm not buying the mystery egg. I'm sure I'm gonna buy a mystery box tomorrow and I don't really like doing mystery stuff too much, so. If I wanna gamble, I just go to a casino. That's the way I see it. I'm gonna go check out the Marvel Legends and see if I can find anything there. All right, so on the way to see the Marvel Legends, we found a 10-inch Bulbasaur. There's a whole egg cap in there. So. Oh, really? Oh, oh, even better. Seems like there's a lot more. I mean, we're not gonna pick it up, but it's pretty cool to see. First time I've seen it. All right, let's move on. Okay, cool, thanks. Ant-Man and the Wasp, Ant-Man and the Wasp, of course, of course. 
That's what I do. Every time I touch a Marvel Legend, I gotta drop it. <laughs> you did say that in one of your videos for sure. Dude, it's every time. It never fails. I'm not doing it on purpose, I promise. <laughs> Alright, so clearly I don't even have to look through this because if OG hasn't found anything, that means there's shit. So, what he said. I'm gonna go check out the clearance aisle because there's nothing here either. So far, Orlando not doing too good. But the day's still young, so I still have hope. That's a lot of bubble war. Wow. Just stacked up. All right, you guys, so that's it for this target. We're gonna move on. I don't know where we're going next, so I can't give you a heads up, but I'll let you know once we're there. We decided to come to GameStop. We're looking for <laughs> this. It's a camera. It's a camera? Yeah. It's a GoPro. Oh, the GoPro. Where? A GoPro. This is a GoPro. GoPro. GoPro? Yeah. Oh, you can sit it down and do all kinds. That is so freaking cool. It's still at Best Buys. Best Buys? Walmart sells it. Walmart? Yeah. So you can just walk and talk and look at yourself? Mm -hmm. it's a, can it videotape you too? Yeah, so I'm doing. <laughs> I wear this shit every day. <laughs> Have a nice day. That is so cool. <laughs> all right. I keep getting interrupted in every intro. Is that a honking horn? It's some person who's never heard of a GoPro. So we're at GameStop. Let's see what we can find. Let's check out the Marble Legends real quick before I look at the pops. I know Seth already found something. Let's check out the pop section. They got the hush? Yeah, it looks like they only got one, but you can have it if you want. That's all right. SpongeBob. The imagination. Five Nights at Freddy's stuff. Squid oh, down there too. Hand me that one. Oh, the Ghostbusters one. Oh man. You didn't see it? No, I didn't see it. Don't ruin it. I'm not trying to. Come on, man. Oh, uh, it's already ruined. No. Ah, that's cool. That's cool. The movie moments. Ghostbuster. That's cool. Have another one down there. Dang it. No. All right, we're gonna no. have to probably get all the game spots now. He's all he's all distraught because the corner's bent. That sucks. Uh, corner I really bent. want this. All right, we're gonna have to hit more game stops so we can get that for you. Definitely. Love this thing. So again, turn it. All right, so we're definitely gonna hit up another game stop. I need this. The Superman push right here. Oh, the box is all jacked up on this one too. Damn, but that is sick. All right, yeah, we're gonna have to hit up another one. We did find something we each wanted, but they only have one of each and they're both messed up. So that sucks. Sure. All right, you guys, we're definitely gonna hit up another GameStop, see if we can find the pops that we're looking for. So I'll see you when we get there. Nice. All right, so in between GameStops, we decided to come to a Walmart. All right, so we just came from the driest Target I've ever seen to the driest Walmart I've ever seen. They have three pops. That's it. Game of Thrones and Captain Marvel. So yeah. Wow. Let's go check out the Marvel Legends, see if we can find anything. All right, so we found the Marvel Legends. Let's move on. <laughs> All right, so obviously they have nothing for Marvel Legends either. I don't know if it's uh, this area of Orlando that I'm in, or this man has very bad luck. One of the two. <laughs> <huh>? <laughs> it's bold. <laughs> it's bold. All right, so let's go find another GameStop. Because, yeah. So if you collect Funko Pops and Marvel Legends, this is not the Walmart you want to be at. But if you collect Mickey Mouse, especially plushes, then you know what? You've hit the jackpot. Holy sh schnauzers. Look at this thing. What? There's a, ch there's a chase. This is a red one and a pink one. We got chases. <laughs> yeah, I guess you guys could tell we are in Orlando. Look at that over there. 
all Mickeys and Minis. It's crazy. All right, that's enough. Let's move on. It's GameStop number two. Two of them left. Perfect. Let's see what they got for the Marvel Legends. Try to do this without dropping one. Let's see if I can accomplish that. I'm so sick of seeing Captain Marvel and Ant Man and the Wasp everywhere. Magneto. Is it over here or on some school reward points? As you say, redeem your points in the power of reward center for PSN and Xbox Live currency. Netflix gift cards, sweet This one's cool. I don't have this one yet. All right, I'm hit the pop wall. Even though I already found exactly what I want behind the counter. Might as well give it a little quick glance. Make sure there's nothing else I want here. Adam's family. I want to get these as well. There's a lot of pops that I got to hunt down. I want to hunt down the Caddyshack pops. Probably next week when I get back to Fort Myers. And after that, probably start doing the Adams Family. Let's see. All right, we're going to see if we can grab the pops behind the counter. And that'll make it a very successful trip to GameStop number two. Sorry guys, I have to interrupt the video here so I can explain to you what's going on on the next clip. Pay close attention to the lady in the dress. She was being scammed by someone claiming to be from the social security office. While we were inside GameStop, she hands us a note asking us to please look up the phone number to the Kissimmee Police Department. I zoomed in the video as much as I could to not get her face on camera. I did not have time to blur it out because that takes time and I don't have much time to edit these videos. I did not add this because I wanted more views. If that was the case, I would have put it in the headline of the video on the title as clickbait, or I would have made a totally separate video based on this footage. So the only reason I'm adding this is because I want to make sure that people don't get scammed like they were trying to scam her. Unfortunately, people do fall for this all the time. So yeah, take a look at this and be careful out there. There's a lot of people out there that are out to make a quick buck. And unfortunately, people do fall for this. How many do I have to get? Hello, Veronica? Four cards. Okay. She had, she had somebody from this phone number calling me with that same phone number. Can you tell me if this number for an arrest is correct? Uh, they gave me they gave me a number for an arrest. I don't know if I want the movie moment. I want one of them. Can I see it? <laughs> Sorry. I don't know what's happening here. It's this one. 
So I don't know if you saw in the video, but even after she spoke to the police and they reassured her that they would never ask her to pay with gift cards, she was still nervous. She was still scared that she had a warrant out for her arrest. So I'm glad at the end she was able to be convinced by everyone that it was a scam and she didn't fall for it. But yeah, it's pretty crazy. So that's it. Back to the video. All right, you guys, we finally made it to Books a Million. We were gonna walk because it's not that far from GameStop. But as we were walking to Books a Million, I'm here having a conversation with Seth and it went something like this. So yeah, you know, and then the And like, yeah, right, Seth? 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 <laughs> and he had disappeared. Why? Because he was hauling down this sidewalk. <laughs> because he left his camera on a bench that we were sitting at talking in front of GameStop. So I've never seen a big man run that fast before. It was impressive. As a, as a big guy myself, he did us proud. Let's just say. <laughs> All right, you guys, we're outside of Books Million. We're gonna go inside now, see what they got. All right, I'm here at the pop section and man, I really wanna pick these up. Just don't wanna get them now. I have to keep them in a bag all weekend and then lug them home with the kids. I really looked through all these Thai web pops and I don't find a chase anywhere, which I really want. He looked at those Thai webs, there was no chases. And I'm still gonna look around, see what else they got. They might have some of the amphibian, man. Oh, dang it. Gotta check for that. Now I gotta dig. All right, let's dig, dig. Dig like you've never dug before. And in the back, there's more. Why do they put them sideways like this? Can't see anything. Nope. But now I gotta dig in the back because there's more back here. That's enough of that. Maybe a yes chase, even though I already have it. Big Bang Theory. I might pick these up too eventually. I do enjoy this show. It's just so much I have to get. I have no room. Got the Aladdin Pops. See what else we can find. All right, let's check the Marvel Legends. See if I can find. I'm missing number six of this wave. Maybe I could get lucky. Maybe. Knock them all over. Yep. It's what I do. By the way, all these boxes are already destroyed. So don't give me any stuff. You know what I mean in the comments about dropping them. Even though I drop Marvel Legends everywhere I go, even when they're in good shape. But in this case, they're not, so it's okay. Got a Hulk statue, I already have this one. 
Still cool though to look at. It's a lot of pops here. Look at these pops on the floor. I feel like there's a cheese around here somewhere. Don't know where. Phoenix. Phoenix. If I would have ran as much as Seth just ran, I would have been all over this place. All right, we're done here? Uh, yeah, yeah, we're done. We are done. All right. Looks like we're done here, so see you guys at the next location. You got your camera? Yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah. All right. All right, that jokes now, huh? <laughs> we made it to Mike's Comets. And then after that, we're heading to the Florida Mall, which is somewhere across the street. Yep. So see you guys inside. All right, I figure we'll start off with the Marvel Legends and work our way because this store has a lot for me to show you. I didn't drop it. This one's cool. Captain America I'm looking for, for Infinity War. Two packs. Oh, I almost dropped them all. I'm gonna look through this. Obviously, if I see anything or get anything, I'm just gonna let you guys know. Top Black Widow, the motorcycle. Of course, it's Deadpool's in every target. Oh, Westworld. Sons of Anarchy. I mean, I wish Walking Dead. You know, that's something I haven't seen yet in What's person. That? It's the Sons of Anarchy pops. Oh, dude, those are old. I know. I would like to get them though. If they have them at the con tomorrow, oh, I might pick them up. More than likely, a ninety-five percent chance they'll have them. I've house. never seen them in person before. All right, you guys. There's way too much for me to show you here, so I'm gonna go ahead and dig. And I'll be right back. All right, I did find two pops that I want. I found this Taz from Space Jam. I used to love this when I was a kid. And might as well take bugs as well. So I'm gonna pick these two up. And I'm gonna keep looking around, I'm not done yet. I actually just started, this is the beginning of the wall. So Lord help me when I get to the end. See you guys in a minute. All right, you guys, so as far as the pops are concerned, I'm only gonna take those two. I'm gonna go ahead and show you some other stuff they got here. And this might take a while. Probably not gonna show you the whole store, but I'll show you what I can. Got this Alien Queen. I actually saw this at Target the other day. I think it's cool, I wanna pick that up. Here we got some Star Wars figures, some Black Series. But I slowed down on the Star Wars stuff. So. Let's take a look at the Hot Toys. This is the, probably the next phase of my life. I don't know yet. You see some of this stuff, like, this is so cool. I know it's hard to see with the glare. You know, for 190 bucks, it's not bad, man. I mean, I buy a few Marvel Legends, a few pops, and I spend 190 bucks easy. Some of these things are up there. But these, some of them are not so bad. This thing's very cool. I love that. Wow, that's nice. That's very nice. 
<laughs> My favorite thing here though has to be this beautiful gladiator hook. I really want to pick that thing up someday. Not today, especially with all the money I'm spending on this trip. My girl will kill me. These turtles are cool. And then, oh wow, look at this thing. How cool is that? 650. Don't touch. Hmm? Trust me, I won't. This thing is massive. <laughs> I got a bunch of loose figures, which I'm not really gonna go through all of this. Oh wait, I see turtles. What the heck are these? I have no idea what that is. Star Wars, Marvel Legends. I got a bunch of stuff. So excuse the glare, I know it's hard to see with the sun behind me, but I would love to have a case that looks like this in my house. It's just all Batman. So cool. Look at this thing. I know the glare sucks, but you guys get the idea? Well, it's not all Batman, but mostly. It's all DC though. Very cool. That's a nice looking piece. They've got some more pops here behind the glass case. This was my fifth hundred pop ever. Love that thing. Ooh. Chicken Deadpool's 25 bucks. They got the, uh, they got the original Peter Wayne in the other case. Yeah. I think I have that one. Gotta check. Hmm. Alright, you guys. I'm gonna go ahead and keep browsing around. I'll be right back. Oh uh, man, I wanna buy a hot toy so bad right now. There's so many here to pick from. I really want this guy. Hmm. Let me walk away. <laughs> All right. Let's see. Let's see. Let's see. Got some necklaces. Simpsons. I would like to pick these up too, but some of them are pretty pricey. And like I keep saying, I don't need to collect anything new. Even though I already have one or two of these. Oh, well, not these, but Simpsons figures. So. All right. I don't want to spend all day here, <laughs> which I can. Oh, easily. But I think I'm going to pick up those two pops and then we're going to head over to the mall. Yeah. See what we can find over there. I needed this. More coffee? What is that, espresso? It's Cuban coffee, it's kind of like espresso. Nah, I'm good, man. I'm not a coffee, I'm not a coffee guy. When you go hunting with Seth, it's like he doesn't stop. It's just like one store after another it's store him, after. Man. He's just he's a hunting machine, so I need a lot of this so I could keep up because I'm just not. You know, I, I can't. And I can't have American coffee. It's too weak. I need the strong stuff for this guy. Ah! And you're spilling it. Spilling it. Every drop counts. That's how nervous he makes me. You know? <laughs> Every drop counts. What is this Crayola stuff? It's just a big store full of Crayola. Know, he, you know what? But he he looks like he needs a hug. So let's let's get let's let's give the let's give the crayon a hug. He is he is a little blue. I'm gonna rub his ball too. There you go. <laughs> oh 
All right, you guys, I'm in a place called World of Toys. Never heard of it before, but they say they have Funko Pops. So we're gonna check it out. I think this is a store that gets everybody's sloppy seconds that they can't sell. <laughs> so, oh, you got Ghostbuster Dogs for you. That's another, that's another venture if you want to get into probably that. Probably like $25. Yeah. $13, something like that. Silicon Valley. Like I said, this is probably some stories, seconds. All right, guys, there's really not much here, so we're gonna move on. So, this is a place where people sit and have fish eat the dead skin, the dead skin off their feet. Good times. <laughs> <laughs> All right, you guys, I'm about to go into box lunch for the second time in my life. I was here last week, not in this one. One in Miami and about the Jaws Pops. So my first time was very cool. Hopefully my second will be just as good. Let's see if we can find anything. See you guys inside. All right, you guys, I just bought this at GameStop and I have no room for that. But now I also want to get this. Something else I have no room for. Uh, and this. I have no idea where I'm going to put them. I have no idea I'm going to pick them up. I really like this though, a lot. How much is this? $32.90. Uh, I don't know if I should hold off. I really gotta start making some room in my closet for all these pops because I mean, I'm not gonna stop collecting. Just walked into GameStop and right away Seth notices Ebony Mall, which I've been looking for now for like two or three weeks. And he pointed it out to me. So. Eye, of the Eye of the Tiger. Eye of the Tiger. <laughs> so very cool that I found this. Very successful trip to GameStop. I'm very happy. It's been a pretty good day. So I think we're going to Think Geek. There's a Think Geek in here? We're going to go to Think Geek. I'll see you guys over there. We're at a Hot Topic. About to go inside and see what they got here at the pop wall and I don't see much of anything I'm gonna go ahead and dig through a little bit and if I find anything I will let you guys know all right you guys we're done at this hot topic I didn't find anything Seth found one pop I think from here we're gonna head over to a think geek so I'll see you guys there Pretty cool. So let's just bought this one at GameStop. Just looked at the pop wall. There's not much there that I'm interested in. So let's look at the Marvel Legends. I don't have anything I'm interested in, but they do have them on clearance for $15. And they got $3 and $5 Funko Pops. But unfortunately, there's nothing here that I want, so I can't take advantage of the deal. Let's keep looking around, see what we can find. Oh, found Seth. You right? Oh, yeah. Sonny, <laughs> yeah. okay. we're hunting too much, man. It's getting to him. This thing is very nice. You know what, you guys? I think I'm going to sell all my Funko Pops and buy this thing instead. What do you guys think? It's only $10,000. Think it's worth it? <laughs> this thing is huge. All right, you guys, I know I didn't show you much here that Think Geek. The thing is that there's really not much here to show you, so yeah, we're done. I think we're done here at this mall. We're going to go grab a bite to eat, so I'll see you guys later. We're back in the room. I'm exhausted. This man has dragged me all over Orlando hunting for pops. He's a madman. I don't know how he... I mean, look at him. He's... I'm, I'm ready for bed. I don't know what he's talking about. Yeah. Ready for bed. There was a GameStop across the street. We'll be running over there right now. I mean, this guy is just... <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we're back in the room. I'm going to show you what I picked up for today. So first, I went to GameStop where I picked up this awesome Movie Moments Pop. I love the way this thing looked. I didn't even know it was out yet. As soon as I saw it, I knew I had to pick it up. The first thing that we saw was a little messed up, so I picked this up at the second GameStop. Love it. Also picked up Dr. Egon, Ghostbusters, and very happy to have that in the collection. Same GameStop, I picked up Mysterio. This pop looks very nice. This is an awesome pop, especially for a common. I love the way this thing looks. I think this is a very nice pop. 
After that, we went to Mike's Comic, where I picked up the Space Jam Pops. I got Bugs, and we got Taz, one of my favorite characters when I was a kid. I have the Looney Tunes one now. I got the Space Jam Pops as well to go with it, so I'm very happy to have that. And then last but not least, thanks to Seth, because if it wasn't for him, I would have missed it. <laughs> he was at the second, actually, this is, yeah, the second this GameStop. This GameStop in the Florida Mall. Yep, and he found Ebony Mall. I've been looking for this thing for a while now. I haven't been able to find it. Super happy I finally got it. And that's about it. That's all I got today. Now, tomorrow is a different story. Tomorrow we're going to Megacon. God knows what I'm going to find there. Uh, I'm very excited about tomorrow. We're actually going to go to bed. Try to get to sleep a little early because we got to be out of here by 8 o'clock in the morning. Because I don't want to miss any of it. So, make sure you guys tune in on Thursday for the Megacon video. It's going to be a lot of fun with myself and Seth from What's Poppin'. And is Vince going to be there? Yeah, Vince, just a geek from the 305 will be there. And then we'll run into a Funko engineer who we ran into at um, Florida Mall. So awesome guy. Go follow him on Instagram. And uh, yeah, yeah. So we're going to be running into a bunch of people tomorrow at MegaCon, man. It's going to be a busy day. A lot of hand, a lot of handshaking, you know, hugging women and kissing babies. <laughs> All right, you guys. So it's going to be a lot of fun. Make sure you check that out. And I'll probably see you guys tomorrow. I'm tired. This might be the end of what's popping. Yeah, bad idea. <laughs> bad idea. Remember, remember how they remember how they tell you don't do this at home? That's exactly what you don't do. <laughs> I won't lie, I won't do that shit either. I hate that board. Dude, he's been trying to get me to write it for like, like a, a few months now. He's like a pro on this freaking thing. Look at this guy. <laughs> Look at this. He's just showed you. Don't try it at home. <laughs> All right, you guys, that's it for us. We are done for tonight. Tomorrow is MegaCon. You're gonna see the MegaCon video come out maybe on Thursday. Make sure. You go check out his channel, MCE What's Pop, and subscribe if you haven't already. So make sure you subscribe, check all the videos out. They're going to be awesome. Like always, guys, thank you for watching.